bird on a tree. I'm just sitting here. Hello and welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I am Titanium Rhino. We have another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2 here. Last we left off, um, Sean and I had just torched the Gray's tobacco fields. So that was fun. Got to commit some arson there and uh, get to know Sean a little bit better. Had a good shootout. Uh, speaking of shootouts, our next mission here is going to be with Micah, so let's see what he has in store for us. Micah? Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called... Hey, Molly, where's Dutch? Well, however it goes... I'm not sure all that line of thought serves you and me very well. Uh, that's because, Cowpoke, you are a man of profoundly limited intelligence. No doubt. Well, you and the old man and Dutch have been running around, digging us oh, ever deeper shave into again. shit. Old Mr. Pearson might have gone and lightened the load a little. Pearson! Ain't you curious? I guess. Gentlemen. Dutch, you tell him, fat man. It's peace, Dutch. The O'Driscolls. I mean, I think there's a way. What on earth are you talking about? Get the words out properly, fat man. I met a couple of the O'Driscoll boys on the road in the town. And things were about to get ugly. But you know how I am in a fight, huh? Like a corner tiger. <laughs> <laughs> right. Anyway, somehow it didn't, but we got to talking, and they suggested a parlay to end things. Like gentlemen. Gentlemen. Yeah. Comb O'Driscoll. <clears throat> Have you lost your minds? You're always telling us, Dutch. Do what has to be done, but don't fight wars ain't worth fighting. They want a parlay? It's a trap. Well, of course, it's probably it's a, a trap. trap. But what have we got to lose finding out? Get shot. We ain't getting shot because you'll be protecting us. It's a trap. You shoot a lot of them. If it ain't a trap, that slim chance. I don't see the point in any of this. It's a chance. You've got to take. I killed Combs' brother a long time ago. Then he killed a woman I loved dear. Mm. As you say, it's a long time ago. Dutch. Why does he have a match in his hat? Let's go. You and me, with Arthur protecting us, no one else. What about me? This ain't the time for tigers, my friend. <laughs> Yeah, no need to bring a knife to a gunfight anyways. Uh, fine. Mount up That's about how I feel about this. Let's go then. So in my not recording time, I've been trying to complete some challenges on the side. I really like the bandit outfit that you can get from the trapper, uh, but to unlock you it, know, you have to complete bandit challenges. I've been fighting Comb for so long now, I can barely remember a time when it was different. And the very first bandit challenge is to hold no up five out. townspeople. Been having a lot of trouble with that. Is there any so many people would rather pull a gun on me than Love let me rob them. Just Which I, I suppose makes sense, but I've only gotten one out of probably 20 attempts to be successful. Yeah. Pinkerton's coming after us because of Blackwater and Leviticus Cornwall and his private army. Then who knows when this local hillbilly <laughs> thing will come to a head. Hmm? Bumper horses. Can we really afford to be fighting on all these fronts and O'Driscoll? There is wisdom in that. Uh, I hope so, gentlemen, but like I said, I'm nervous. Look, you ain't even going to be the one in danger. We'll get on over there, find a nice perch for you to settle into. You got that rifle, don't you? Yeah, yeah. Then me and Dutch walk right in to the lion's den with you to... 
cover us, hmm? Okay. Just keep calm. Unless I give you a reason not to. Oh, we'll be fine. We got you. I will do my best. Oh, my dear and trusted <laughs> friend, with you watching over me, I would walk into hell itself. As would I. Yeah, I wouldn't walk in with Micah covering me, though. Just as likely shoot me. Hey, up there. Men on the ridge. Old Driscoll's from the look of them. I don't oh, they got the high ground. Eyes on us. We're close. You'll be the eyes soon enough. Yeah, but now they know there's three guys coming. Maybe he's right, Dutch. Maybe I have pushed too hard. Got us into situations that could have been safer. I just... I see all those mouths we gotta feed, and I... I dream too big. Caring too much. That's my problem. Caring uh -huh. too much? There's no <laughs> such thing. This is horse shit from both of you. It might be. <laughs> My sentiments exactly. Micah might be full of shit. Como Driscoll might be full of shit. The promise of this great nation. Men created equal. Liberty and justice for all. That might be nonsense too. But it's worth trying for. It is worth it. Believing in. Can't you see that, friend? I don't know. Try. I suppose so. All I ask is you try. All right, cowpoke. You're gonna peel off up ahead. We'll be meeting down on the plane. Find a spot just above us where you can keep an eye on things. All right, all right. However this shakes out, let's aim to meet back at the fork in the road afterwards. We'll be there, partner. All right, then. I got that rare rolling block rifle. Uh, here's the thing. There were four guys up on the ridge already. They saw three of us coming. Don't you think they're going to report that there were three of us and then be suspicious that there's only two? Hey. Street damage. I feel like all of that's going to be worth it. Next to a dead animal. All right. Four before, now there's three. Hello, Dutch. It's been a while. <clears throat> sure. So, uh, how's your gang doing? They still believing in you? Better world. Pure world. Hmm? How's that coming along? Just fine. Mm. I do like my guns. How's that score you stole off us? Which one? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like that. It's like I said, this is a charismatic leader. A lot of heat on us this time. Both of us. A whole heap of trouble. They offered me a price, Dutch, to bring you in. Why didn't you take it? Well, still might. I am... Um, Who <laughs> says he didn't? Sorry. About your brother. Yeah, well, I never liked him much. I liked Annabelle. 
You always love the ladies, Dutch Vanderlyn. I like that about you. What are we doing here? Go home. What a slippery Is this thing dude. Over. Yep, told ya. Hello, sugar. You ain't dead, is you? Not. <laughs> Column's got a sense. Uh, handing him over to the lords. I don't know. Escape. Strange times. They killed Seamus. Fuck the whole lot of them. With this fella Column's right, we can draw them all back. True. <laughs> Where'd Column and Patrick get off? <laughs> In a town, I think this. He's escaping! Shoot him! Relax! Relax. I got him. I got him. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, of course not. Uh, not yet. But I will. Okay, so don't escape that way. On a horse? Sounded like Sean. It's a bit surreal. Arthur Morgan. It's good to see you. Oh man. How's woo? I hardly feel it. You will. <laughs> Septic. Now, tell me. Fine gun like you. But why are you still running around with old Dutch? Could come ride with me and make real money. It ain't about the money, Cole. No, no. It's Dutch's famous car. <laughs> Uh, you killed a whole bunch of my boys. Yes, I did. I ain't got no clue what you're talking about. Oh, you lie, my friend. But I thought Dutch preached true. Let me go, Cole. And then all this crap between you two. We all got real problems now. The way I see it, they get him. They forget about me. They ain't not likely. Sword. If I were you, I'd run as soon as I had him. <laughs> oh, I know you would. I see. We lure an angry Dutch in to rescue you. Grab all of you and hand you in. Then disappear. So you only met with him. Oh, so I'm the bait. Me? Of course. He's gonna be so mad. He gonna come raging over. Game over. Sack cloth hood. Swing on your shackles. Reach the metal file. Use to pick the lock.
God, that hurt just to watch. Powder, cauterize. This happens to be a single shot sitting down there. Take his gear and his gun. Throwing knives. That's all he had. What's he still doing down there? It's one thing torturing a man, it's another thing putting him through stories of the homeland. He better hurry it up. I don't want to be here when the law comes for that side of beef. Loot it. Son of a bitch. Oh my god. This is insane. What's he still doing down there? It's one thing torturing a man, it's another thing putting him through stories of the homeland. He better hurry it up. I don't want to be here when the law comes for that side of me. Pick it up. There we go. Oh my god, there are people literally everywhere. everything. There should be a gun sitting here. Where is it? There it is. 
all my gear back. map here. Holy buckets. Right all the way back there. All right. I guess they'll probably be chasing me the whole way too. My god. Oh shit! Nope! Get off! Get off! Get off! Get off! Get off! Get off! Damn! <laughs> that was a bad idea. <laughs> oh god! Oh, who knew there'd be a train there? Oh, all the way back here. Shit. All right. <laughs> What's he still doing this is so there? bad. It's one thing torturing a man, it's another thing putting him through stories of the homeland. You better hurry it up. I don't want to be here when the law comes for that side of beef. There we go, loot him. Kill three enemies in ten seconds using only throwing knives. This seems like the mission to do that with, but I'm not going to give that a try. Not yet. Forget the stuff inside. I'm just getting my gear. Getting the hell out of here. waiting for more to hit the fan. Yep.
Well, this hasn't been anything less than exciting, I'll tell you that. <laughs> oh, man. Swanson's gonna set the law on us. Oh, of course he was. I'm sorry, <laughs> Arthur. It is a bit late for apologies. Swanson! Mr. Morgan. Another fail Mr. from Morgan, Pearson. You're safe now. Oh, let's get him to bed. God. Between Pearson, safe, Micah, and Uncle, it's a wonder we're not all arrested. Yeah, that's pretty. Tough. That's real pretty. Miss Grimshaw, will you sit with him a while? Of course. You'll be okay, Mr. Morgan. You're home. Just one of them things. Ooh, wolf dream. Actually, it looks like a coyote. few weeks, dang. That sepsis really knocks you out, huh? I thought I'd be burying you, Mr. Morgan. Well, not quite yet, River. Good. Full beard. God, you need to shave. Oh, uh, about the same as you. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> well, take care of yourself. You too. I'm gonna need to take care of this hair. Your beard won't grow any longer. It's been that long. <laughs> oh man. Free yourself and perform self surgery within a minute. That was the only thing I missed, huh? Recover your weapons, kill the O'Driscoll gang members that beat and shot you. Without being spotted. Okay. I feel like a gold on that would be pretty possible. Just need to free myself faster next time. Alright. Anyways, that is the end of the episode. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. That was crazy. And yeah, who knew there would be a train coming down the tracks right then? That's unfortunate for me. Uh, looks like our next mission here is going to be that B on the map. Let's see what that is, where it's located. It's not in camp. B, Bill. Oh, good. Got another mission for Bill. All right, so thanks for joining me. Leave any questions, comments, concerns down and below. Next time you see me, I'll be all clean-shaven, geared up, and ready for this ultimate uh, Bill mission, which is probably going to end about as poorly as the last one did. So, again, thanks for joining me, and as always, keep on gaming. In the great outdoors, forever free.